And now to the big news out of the 2021 session, the landmark tax bill passed by the House this week. It would slash the grocery tax, eliminate the income tax for many, but it would also hike the tax on a lot of items, including farm equipment. 12 News of Town Todd talked with farmers about the potential impact. Town. Yeah, that's right, Byron. Now, commuting members and lawmakers are hoping legislators in the Senate will pump the brakes on a bill heading there, authored by House Speaker Philip Gunn, among other Republican leaders. A bill in the works that raises the sales tax may have farmers thinking twice about purchasing that big ticket farm item. It's uh, a necessary part of production agriculture. Can't do without it. You can't farm without equipment. Mississippi Tax Freedom Act of 2021, House Bill 1439 proposes to raise the sales tax on farm tractors and parts to nearly triple from 1.5 to 4 percent. Samson Jackson II represents District 32 in Mississippi. He's been a farmer all his life and says this bill will only hurt farmers as agriculture makes up Mississippi's number one industry. There's very few farmers make, make, profit, make a profit. Mississippi Commissioner of Agriculture and Commerce Andy Gibson says while most people are not opposed to reducing the state income tax, there is still some tweaks to be made. Gibson acknowledges the role farmers play, stretching back to the start of the pandemic. They were so important during the pandemic, you know, when people couldn't get food, where did they go? They went to the farmer's market. They were able to buy local food to eat and to survive because our farmers had, were able to produce it locally. According to data, agriculture brings in at least $7 billion to Mississippi and employs approximately 29% of the state's workforce. Now, the bill would also cut the tax on groceries from 7% to 4%. Byron, back to you.